Hello, everybody. Anomalous Zero here with another episode of Strong Bad's amazing game for beautiful, just loving people like yourself. Uh, we have to defeat the Tarantula with its fire head, its ice head, and its standy. Tarantula being a band uh, to prove ourselves to Strong Mad to get him to join Strong Badia. First thing I'm going to do is try to burn this paper mache skull. We will cleanse the earth with fire. Okay. Can I just... Whoa! That papier is almost as flammable as regular manly paper. Okay. The moon in the sky, a gentle breeze, the waves lapping the shore, and a pile of flaming skulls. It's downright homey. Yeah. All right. Um. Quake in the face of pure awesomeness, foul creature. Okay. Fire breath. Ow. Ice breath. Um, a body blow would be useless against the beast, and ruin the resale value of a totally awesome stolen concert souvenir. So I wonder, you see those lines right there? Avanti! Oh, look at that! Head regrows. The head regrows. The head regrows. What bullshit? Oh, while well, he's doing that. Your reign of terror ends here! Oh. <laughs> it still lives for Angela! Hmm. Can I chop this off now and it'll go in the water? Yeah, because he was too busy squirting uh, the tomato sauce or ketchup. Did I win? Oh, why is Strong Man, why? You told me to. The great beast will live on in the recycling bin of our hearts. I did it. Bring Tony Stoney! Oh, uh, Tony Stoney's your vice president. I see. Uh, sure. He can come along, strong man. Man! Tony Stoney's put on some pounds since he's been in office. Dateline country, once a proud land filled with proud person. This developing nation now waves a new flag, the Strong Bedian Empires. Their army taken over. Their most endangered species driven to extinction. What can stop this red menace? The menace. Menace. Sorry, thought that was an Italian word. Oh, and it just automatically takes me here. That's convenient. The red menace. Oh, so now there should just be five people here, right? One, two, three, four, five. Which means we have enough people for the army. Now, do you have enough soldiers for the Homest Army? That's a negatory. The peace draft is our only hope. I'm pository about that. Hmm. Seems like a lie, but okay. Oh. Can I put the stone in here? From the country of country, a giant rock I've been impossibly keeping in my pants. Aha! The balance of power has shifted. In your pants, you say. Oh, my. Uh, so now that'll, like, change the display or the, the spinny wheels thing. You should run that draft again before it's too late. We may already be too late. And welcome back to Hopes of Pants Peacetime Draft Stravaganza. Let's see who's today's lucky winner. What's with that frame there that blinks? I don't even know if you'll see it in the recording. Hopes of winner. I believe the winner is right here in our studio. I can't make me sore, fascist. 
Uh oh, looks like we got us an artful draft dodger, ladies and gentlemen. Yo, war, yo, war, what are all y'all's fighting for? What is my major malfunction, private? Homestar, you can't draft yourself. Really? Wish I'd known before I signed up for this chicken outfit. Never mind. Bacock! No ghost, bro, bro. Oh, keep trying. Whoa. Wait, what? These moved around. Huh. Where's Kochistan? There's concession stand, concession stand, but where's coach or coach Chania? Huh? Interesting. So that didn't work. Nothing in Strongman's display, but some wadded up paper and uh... oh, the lands will be united. Uh, my huh. Tony, Tony, what are you doing out here? Wouldn't you be more comfortable in the tight waistband of my inventory? I don't get it. A contra... The display? Can I just put it anywhere, maybe? Oh. A balance of power. I can. So what do I want it to hit? Run the drop. Okay. And welcome back to Hopes of Pants Peacetime Draft Stravaganza. Let's see who's today's lucky winner. I don't even know what I want it to hit is the problem. Tom Benedetta. No go. Oh. And welcome back to Hopes of Pants Peacetime Draft Stravaganza. I don't. I don't know which one's the Let's good see one. Who's today's lucky winner. Ramon Benedetto? No more! I can't look into Mrs. Benedetto's eyes and- No ghost, Ramon. Oh. I don't get it. I think I might want- Well, you can put a national treasure in the- I don't- I don't get it. I- I don't know which one I'm supposed to be. Which one represents the good option there? I'm just going to do them all. Aha, the Cut to it working. Shifted. Cut to it working. Little Bridal! Oh, little Bridal! Why? Why is the world so hard on all the little one legged creatures? Burn me in the front line, Sarge. I'm gonna be a four star general someday. No! Why did I even put that on the board? No ghost. Oh. And the lucky winner is Code Z. Really? I never won anything before in my life. Recruit, are you willing to put your life and some cool camos on the line to defend my country? I think they've all overbid. One dollar, one dollar. Close enough. Welcome to the home, Stormy soldier. Was... Hey, Star, I told you I don't like you having all your friends over to watch the game and plan paramilitary operations without asking me first. Oh, you granola bars are all the same, except for the ones with chocolate chips. You enjoy your freedom to not wash your hair and play hacky sack, but aren't willing to put an orange bowl on your head and wave a spoon around. Okay, that is it, Homestar. We are through. Good. Fine. Battle! Your side is East Mars' star, and my side is East Home Japan. Midway along the border, we'll set up Checkpoint the Cheat. Why don't you just make your own country at your house? No way! There's a squirrel in the attic that I sometimes think is a spooky ghost. Whatever. All right, maggots. I tell I you call this a home star me? Somebody's gonna have to whip these wastes of panty wastes into shape. Take it away, your dryness. Just let me know when you want to start attacking the castle. The first thing you'll notice about the of town is that he smells like fresh baked breads. Do not be fooled. Uh, 
Okay, was We've got to hit him where all old people are the weakest. Right in the park. Was Coach Z there the entire time? Do I make myself clear? Sir, yes, sir. Am I boring you, Private? Um. I have something to share with the rest of the class? I'm the local Leroy. Sure are, Homesar. Do you want to die, soldier? Hmm, well... Shape up, Private! Oh, sorry, sir. <laughs> Poor Strong, mad. On to the castle! Death to the off town! Guess I did it. Revelation! Slow motion. My dearest Marzipan, the siege on the castle continues. We are forever surrounded by the brown stench of war and the constant beige screaming. Glow. Always the Gross. beige screaming. We have suffered great losses. The cheat was the first to turn tail and join the enemy, quickly followed by the traitorous Coach Z, which incidentally is his new rap name. I've done things I'm not proud of. I can only dream of the day when this madness ends and I can return to your ahem, arms once again. Your lovable cuddliness, Homestar Waddle. Don't be stupid, Homestar. Okay. The siege lasted five minutes and that was a week ago. It was like the King of Town wanted to give up. The Homestar we sure showed him a thing or twelve. Whatever. I just wanted to tell you again to pick up your stupid draft wheel from my house. I need the yard for my Down with the King rally. Now I'm going back down to protest you slash everything you stand for. Okay, Marzipan, Pig, call me. Uh, how could I have known being King of Town would suck so many eggs? Right, how couldn't I have known? There, there, my liege. That emptiness you feel inside, I want you to take that and cram it full of chimichangas. Okay, I guess I'm the king now. I did it. Yay me.